So what happens if you keep rubbing your eyes a lot? Now we have a similar case here. She is just 16 years of age, and she has a very bad habit of rubbing the eyes. So if you see, this is her corneal topography reports. As you can clearly see, these are the red areas. Red area in the scan basically tells us that the cornea is extremely steep and it is very thin. Now her thickness in the right eye is 463. Ideally, the corneal thickness should be somewhere around 550, and the left eye is about 450. So that means both eyes there is keratoconus. Left eye is little more severe than the right eye. That is the reason why we are doing collagen cross-linking with riboflavin. We've just uh, scraped the epithelium and we just put riboflavin. And this riboflavin is basically put once every minute. As you can see here, just putting one drop of riboflavin fluid. So this is the CTR procedure, which basically we do it for about 20 minutes of this fluid. And then we expose the eye for UVA radiation for about 10 minutes. What this basically does is it strengthens the cornea. So it strengthens the cornea in such a way that the collagen bonds are becoming strong. And it makes sure that the cornea is not further thinned out. Again, the CTR procedure is not done to improve the problem or it's not done to get rid of the glasses or to improve the vision but it is done to basically make sure that the problem stays right there so it stops the progression of the disease that is the keratoconus and it is very important that you don't go back to the habit of rubbing the eyes then that is very very important such young patients who are just 16 years of age who have this habit of rubbing the eyes it is really important that they stop rubbing so that is something that you need to completely avoid as you can see the patient is very comfortable we don't give any injection it's done only with uh, topical anesthetic drops and uh, there's no pain there's no discomfort during the procedure post surgery there is some discomfort within uh, two to three days time they'll be completely fine so because the left eye is more severe we have done the left eye today after one week two weeks then we can plan for the right eye